ShoeQ's visual workflow allows you to get a broad overview of all of your workflows and lets you see the progress for all of your shoots and products. In this tutorial, we'll discuss how to use this feature and utilize some of its main options so that you can stay more organized with all of your jobs. The Visual Workflow section can be found under the Tasks tab. By default, you will initially see all of your shoot and product workflows in different grids. In my account, I have several shoot workflows and a couple of product workflows. Each workflow will show you which shoots are associated with it. Product workflows will also show you the actual products being fulfilled. Using the filters at the top, you can choose which workflows you want to see. You can sort them by brand and also by workflow. For example, I'll set a filter to see only the family portrait workflow in all of my brands. You can also clear your filters in the same way. Clicking on the Shoot and Product buttons allows you to quickly toggle between showing and hiding those types of workflows. For instance, when I turn the Shoot button off, my Shoot workflows are hidden. In the same way, toggling the Product button will hide my product workflows. When I turn on those buttons, the hidden workflows become visible again. As you can see, filters are a convenient way to view only certain workflows. Each workflow grid shows the shoots and events associated with it. If a grid has more than 10 shoots, just choose the inner vertical scroll bar. Notice how you can easily jump to a particular shoot's workflow just by clicking on the shoot name. The workflow's milestones will be arranged at the top of the grid. Completed milestones have a checkmark indicator. A checkmark in a green circle means the milestone was completed on time. A checkmark in a red circle indicates it was completed after its due date. And a checkmark in a yellow circle means the milestone is completed, but the workflow is currently on hold. An open circle indicates a milestone has not yet been completed. An open green circle means the milestone's due date is upcoming but it's not past due. An open red circle, on the other hand, means that it is overdue. And an open yellow circle means the milestone is not completed, but the workflow is on hold. In this way, you can gauge whether or not you are completing your milestones and tasks on time, and you can also quickly see if a particular job is behind schedule. Hovering over a status allows you to mark off a milestone's tasks. It also shows you the milestone due date and any milestone correspondence. If you check off a task accidentally, you can always uncheck it. And if you want to complete all of the tasks in a milestone at once, just click on the status. To complete the entire workflow and all of its tasks at once, click the Complete button on the far right. When it's completed, the shoot disappears from the grid. It's important to note that when the entire workflow is completed in this way, any milestone correspondence is not automatically sent to clients. These emails are removed from the email queue. This Complete button is a great way to quickly clean up your visual workflow section if you have actually completed a workflow, but just haven't marked off those tasks yet in shoot queue. Sometimes it's necessary to pause a workflow or change its milestone due dates. To change the due dates, just click this gear icon. You can also put a workflow on hold and resume it from this section as well.
There is also a full screen mode which will clean up your view by removing such things as the navigation bar, filters, and browser controls. To exit full screen mode, just click the escape button on your computer. Sometimes a workflow will be modified. Perhaps you add or remove milestones to it. In cases like this, both versions of the workflow will be visible. In my example, these shoots have my original wedding workflow. And these shoots have my newly updated wedding workflow which contains more milestones. Both of these are visible as grids and they show which shoots have which workflow, even though they both have the same name. In conclusion, hopefully you can see there are many useful aspects to the visual workflow. This feature is geared to help you analyze the progress of your shoots and the fulfillment of products for your clients. It's a great tool that will give you a bird's eye perspective of your workflows, and it'll help you stay organized and on track when executing your tasks so that your jobs are completed efficiently and thoroughly.